I'm here at Julep in Paracel Park, Irvine. This is their largest residence. It has a very nice main floor. Here we go, main floor bedroom. And this is Lisa Walters. I love when a house has a main floor bedroom. Great place for guests or noisy teenagers, which I have some. The other option that you can use this room for is a really good workspace or a den if you don't need that third bedroom. There's the downstairs bath. And then this opens up into a nice big great room. The living area, the kitchen and dining area. And then they have this nice little cabinetry here right when you come in from the garage. I really like that. Keeps it clean. You can put your, your uh, packages, your purse, and your clutter when you walk in the door from the garage. There's a nice little patio big enough to put a table and chairs and a barbecue and a water feature if you'd like. We'll go outside and take a peek. Now they've put in the folding doors that open all the way up. I really like that. It's a great option of bringing the outdoors in. So let's go upstairs and see the rest of the living area. Oh, here's another thing. Because I'm all about the storage, I love when they use these big closets and it goes all the way underneath the stairs. Really pretty little. I'm gonna back up and let you see this. I really like this landing area of the stairs. When you come and see a new home, they have their salespeople here, and people always say, Lisa, why would I use you? There's a sales associate there for me. And I let them know that I'm here to consult, negotiate, and oversee all of your transactional details. I'm working for you, not for the builder. I really enjoy this master bedroom. It's very spacious. The master bath is big too. So this one is about a little over 2,100 square feet. They've used the space nicely, giving you chances of storage when you can get some storage. Nice walk-in closet. There's the throne room. And a balcony off the master, which I really like. A nice, quiet, peaceful place to sit close the door and get away from the world. There's a lot of those little nooks in this house where you can kind of sit and I like that. Here's another one right across from the master and the stairs. Just a little sitting area. You can look outside. This particular area looks out into, um, its door won't open, but it looks out into the, the park area which is really nice. And then we have the washer and dryer room. And this is included, the sink and the cabinets. Then this is the third bedroom. There's also another, it's not big enough to put a chair in, but you can stand out there and say hi to your neighbors or just open the door and get some nice fresh air with a nice bathroom. And let's go upstairs and see the pièce de résistance to this place. I'm really impressed with how they did this. A lot of times when you go upstairs for a living area, they'll just have the rooftop deck and there's not much else up there. But this area, it's kind of indoor outdoor so that you can use this again if you want just for another office area, study room, playroom, or you can do what they've done which is to put this kitchen so if you're entertaining, you don't have to bring your stuff up and down the stairs. And then there's a nice sitting area out here. Very large, as you can see, it's got this sectional sofa. I really like that added touch. You can see all the building here going on in Parasol Park. And this is Lisa Walters. Contact me if I can help you.